Oh god. Oh, there was one girlfriend who I had, uh, I dated her for like maybe two months. And didn't have sex with her right off the bat. And then, about a month into our relationship, she told me that she had herpes. And I was like, huh, interesting. Not having sex then. <laughs> and I spent like the next month trying to break up with her. I was trying to be nice about it, but I also didn't want her to think I was breaking up with her because she had herpes, even though that was basically the reason why. So I was just like, yeah, let's not. Let's not. So every time she was trying to fucking... She was trying to get, like, trying to act, get me to have sex with her, I'm like, eh, that's a no! That's a no! That's a no! <laughs> that pussy be hurt. Oh, man. It's kind of awkward, because I was just like... I was trying to be nice about it. And then I was... But she basically... She basically, because I refused to have sex with her, she assumed I had P.E. Uh... So I was like, uh, nope. Cause you got herpes. That's why. <laughs> Sorry, that's why. Girl wanted to raw dog it after she told, uh, she told she had something like that. I'm like, nope, nope, nope. <laughs> yeah, nah, dude. Fuck that, man. I was like, uh, that's a no for me. Sorry, that's a no. Glad she told me before the fact, though. Rather than after the fact, because after the fact, I would have been pretty pissed. But yeah, that was, uh, that was a little bit awkward. Yeah. Yeah, it's, uh... Ugh. Yeah, no thank you. No T-Y. I've never understood how this monster works. I swear, like, based on when you hit it, what's showing on the screen, different things pop out of the bottom there. It, there's a whole subreddit for Tinder horror stories. It's pretty amazing. Dude, I love reading those stories, man. Oh, man. Some of them, you read them and you're just like, holy fuck. Okay, we can't go in there. Um, yeah. I've, uh, there's a lot of other stories I could tell, but... We might save them for later. We might save them for another stream. Oh man. Not for Charlie Sheen. Does that mean HIV is the incel STD? Oh man. Goddamn. Yeah, that was uh, that was a big yikes for me, man. It was bad. I I felt bad for her really, cause like she was relatively nice, but then she got turned really feral. When I refused to have sex with her. I was like, uh Yeah, no, thank you. Everything's ready for tonight's experiment, Professor Ojo. Implying insults have had sex or even human contact. <laughs> oh, it feels bad, man. Excellent, we're starting right away. Raise it to the pot above. What about all the vol cells? Voluntary celibates, what about them? At least I'd imagine that's what you would call it, a vol cell. Voluntary, I guess. Yeah, that makes sense. Hey, it's Red 13, my boy. My man. Red 13. Precious specimen. Is it going to be used for a biological experiment? Uh, yes. Yes, it is. Oh, here we go. We're gonna see high res Genova. Genova. <laughs> In insert that fucking audio clip of a fucking Tyler one. Get out of my fucking head! <laughs> Genova, Sethroth. So they brought it here. Was that an eyeball tit? Yes, it was. Pretty much. It's moving. Still alive? When you get that message to come over and chill? Yeah, I know, right? Uh, sometimes you're like, oh yeah, cool. Sometimes you're like, oh, no thank you. Where's its fucking head? The whole thing's stupid. Let's just keep going. Oh, man. 
All right, let's go. God, I remember one time, uh, a few months ago, I was like, uh, about to go to sleep, and then I saw my phone flash, I was like, what the fuck? This is when I still had Snapchat installed. And then, I looked at it, I'm like, what the fuck, why? It was, it was like a Snapchat from an ex girlfriend of mine. And she, she sent me like a video of her, and she was like smoking a bong. And like, she was, like, she was trying to be kind of flirty, like, oh, you should come over and smoke weed with me. And I was like, I don't smoke weed anymore. And I, lo I, lo I looked at the notification, I was like, fuck off, and just I just like turned my phone off and went to sleep. And I woke up in the morning, like, looked at the video, and I was like, nope, fucking deleted Snapchat. <laughs> I was just like, not. Nah, I don't use Snapchat anymore, I don't know why I still had it installed. I'm getting that message, yep, fuck Snapchat off, let's go. Out of here. Little did you know she wanted five dollars? <laughs> fuck me. Hang on a sec. Ugh. Five dollars! Give me five dollars! Ah, I'm a cunt! Give me five dollars! Ah. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, here we go. Try to get Black Ops th uh, 3 Platinum right now. Oh, nice. It's actually easy, yeah? Is it actually easy? Nice. I haven't tried to get it before, so I don't know. Aerith. Oh, is that her name? What do you want? Sometimes those texts are awesome, though. Yeah, sometimes they are nice if you actually wanted to fuck an ex, but... I have no interest in doing that with any of my exes, so I'm all good. You should try it? Yeah, I do have Black Ops 3 somewhere. I'm pretty sure it's in my collection. We're taking Aerith back. Not an actual ex, but yeah. Okay, yeah. It's like, from that, just from a chick. Yeah, I, I, I appreciate that. Yeah. Interesting, is that why you think you're here? Better believe it. I wasn't talking to you. I don't advise doing anything rash. You see my assistant back there? That console he's operating can purge the specimens held inside the capsule at a moment's notice. Uh, that's right. I recommend you think things out logically before making any rash moves. Now, let's begin the experiments. Here we go. I'll have to try and figure out how to get the mod which replaces the character models, like the main character models. What do you think you're doing? Because like all, like all the NPC models are replaced, but the main characters aren't. I wouldn't mind trying, figuring that out, because I would like to have the main characters replaced as well, so they're, they're, they're not so out of place, you know? The president wants the Ancient to lead him to the Promised Land, but her powers are too weak, so we'll reinforce that connection to the planet through combat, hence the current experiment. That's terrible. Aerith is a human being. Cunt, you're gonna pay. Barrett, shoot the door. Alright, step back. Stop! Oh shit. When someone you've been chatting to on Tinder is like, I had a really shitty date. You up slash free. That's a good feel. <laughs> you help with zombies message me on PSN or something? Alright, man. Yeah, I mean, I'm... I'm going to be putting all my, all my energy into GTA 4 next, but if I do eventually get to that, yeah, sure, man. What are you doing, my precious experiments? Oh, kitty! Hey! Oh! Kitty, you got to move. And Red 13, go. Attack. I recommend you think things out logically before you say any rash moves begins shooting... <laughs> begins shooting the containment chamber. Dude, I know, right? Now's our chance to get Aerith. My cousin! My cousin! Let's go bowling! Thanks, Cloud. Oh, shit! Cloud, what's wrong? The elevator's moving again. Something's coming up. I had other specimens prepared. That one's rather strong. I'll help you all out. It talks! I'll talk as much as you want later, miss. <laughs> We'll take care of that monster. Somebody get Aerith out of, out of here. Uh... Tifa, I'm counting on you. What's your name? Herja has named me Red 13. A name with no meaning to me. Call me whatever you wish. We'll go- we'll stick with Red 13. 
Red 13's innate ability. As the battle progresses, Red 13 will steadily gain strength and magic up to a maximum of 50 for both. Ooh! So like maybe like each turn he gets an extra plus on that? That's fucking sick. He's a about to be like a perfect boss battle companion. Hell yeah. Oh! The fuck is he doing? Fortifies his defenses. I'm not sure what he did just then, but it didn't look very good. Now gonna match Red 13 with a Gordon Ramsay voice? <laughs> Jesus. What the fuck? Man, if only we had enemy skill for that. Oh, oh, he doesn't have enemy, have enemy skill. Never mind. Fuck yeah. Nice. OPT Blast. Alright, we might want to heal. Next round, maybe? Yes, definitely. Nice. I don't know if you've ever watched um, Machina Bridge, but you should definitely watch Machina, uh, Machina Bridge. It's like a Final Fantasy VII by uh, OBT Overpowered Titties. <laughs> yep. Absolutely. Good damn. He got them overpowered titties. Spoiler, it's all of them. Yeah, no, Machina Bridge is awesome. It's uh, made by Team Four Star. Oh god. Re and a What the fuck? Oh god. Shit. Here we go. Blade Beam. Yeah, it's made by Team Four Star. It's fucking, it's hilarious, man. It's so good. Nice. So we just keep taking them out, and then he gets weaker. Awesome. Oh god, putrid breath. Is that poison? Everyone, everyone. Okay, never mind. All good. Pure on everyone. Sled Fang. When you go back to uni, will you do evening streams? Yeah. Um, uh, my streaming schedule will stay relatively the same. Just like in the mornings before stream is when I'll do my uni work. Is the inspiration for my full app build of choice? Yeah. Nice. You mean the shrunk style build? Because yeah, uni starts up again in three weeks. Um... So when, yeah, when that starts up again, my, my streaming schedule should stay, yeah, about relatively the same most of the time. Um, and then just, as, long as, I, as long as every morning I do a good chunk of uni work, then we'll, I'll be able to do the same schedule, so yeah. The Cannibal Raptor is too far. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Nice. Um. Nice. Same days with evening streams. Or still, I'll, I'll, I'll probably. So rather than starting at 12, I'll probably start at 1 instead. And then, um... Yes, yeah, so I'll probably be starting at 1, and then, uh, going until 7. Because right now it's 12 until 6, usually. A bit longer today, just because we want to finish all of Midgar today. Um, but yeah. So it, sh it Oh! 
Nice! That's a dead bitch right there. Awesome. Should I play Destiny 2 or Minecraft Sky Factory? Mm. Uh, I haven't played Destiny 2 in ages, eh? I wouldn't mind trying to platinum that game on PS4. Or in the original Destiny, because I don't have much left in the original Destiny as far as trophies. I think I just need to get the um, uh, clearer raid without dying trophy. I have a right to choose two. I don't like two-legged things. The hell is that supposed to mean? Also, what are you? An informed but diff difficult question. I am what you see. Let's leave explanations for later. First, let's get out of here. Cloud, so did you come for me? I apologize for what happened back there. I was acting to throw off uh, Hojo's guard. Now that we've saved Aerith, ain't no need to be in this building. So let's get out of the, get the hell out of here. We'll draw too much attention together. Let's break up into two groups. Um... Change party. Hmm. I think I'll go with these guys, actually. Yeah. Oops, there we go. See you later. We'll always be waiting outside. This seems to have improved quite a lot. I'm going my way to a thousand light to do an exotic quest without getting but fucked. Oh, okay, nice. Hey, what, 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 are you, what are you playing it on? You're playing on PC or console? Uh, we'll be going first. Is it crossplay now? Cross console and PC? Um, I'm kind of curious if it is. Uh, we'll be going first. Meet up outside Shinra HQ. You sure about that? Sure that's what's going to happen? I don't think so. Uh, wait, what the fuck? This way. Oh, hello. Um. <clears throat> yeah, but, but, so when uni starts, I think if I've got assignments and shit due, I might maybe skip a day of streaming just so I can get those assignments done. But if I stick to that same schedule of like doing three hours each morning of uni work, I think I'll be fine. Um. So yeah, we'll see how we go, man. We'll cross that bridge once we, cut, once we get to it. Oh fuck. God damn. Uh, what? Bitch, are you dumb? <laughs> Apparently. PC Master Race cross save is a thing, but not cross play. Ah, okay. Oh, they had cross play. That'd be sweet. Because I obviously only have it on PlayStation. Well, I have it on PC, but. For playing on PlayStation. For the trophy, son! Okay, let's get Barrett to heal everyone. Yeah. Dead. Never mind. Nice speed drink. Hell yeah, bro. Need that speed drink. Uh, please don't kill me. I only did what Hojo told me to do. Here, let me take make it up to you. This is the key card for the 68th floor. Would I be doing this if I was the enemy? Nice. What a good lad. Oh, it's downstairs, never mind. Cool, uh, potion and potion. Awesome. I'll take those extra items. This speed drink is just pure liquid cocaine? Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Party time. Lapel. Shit. Uh, 
There we go, heal everyone. Woo, critical baby. I love that counter-attack, dude, with Barret. It's so good. Ugh. This guy's almost dead, yeah? Might play everything? I mean, I just bought... Yeah, that's a good idea. I'll have to check it out after the stream. There's a, the game's literally just called everything. Yeah? Let's see if I remember to check it out after the stream. After the stream, I want to go have dinner and shit. But yeah. Uh, is there an elevator here? No, never mind. Gotta go down another floor to get to the elevator. Actually, we probably want to go to uh, the gym floor first. And save there. Oh man. Throw you some magic on them, yeah? Out. Fire! Oh man. But yeah, you guys should check out my schedule as well. Just for those of you who might not know my schedule, you might be tuning in. Uh, my schedule at the moment, for reference. So Monday, Tuesdays, we're doing Final Fantasy VII. At the moment, once we finish this Final Fantasy VII playthrough, then we're going to be doing uh, World of Final Fantasy. Wednesdays through Friday is Grand Theft Auto 100%ing, so next one is uh, GTA 4, and then once we've 100%ed that and got the Platinum Trophy, we're doing GTA 5. And then after that, we'll change to a different game series, Monday, Wednesdays through Friday. Saturdays at the moment, we're doing Dreams, and then Need for Speed Heat, and then Sundays, Animal Crossing to chill out, you know? And then after Animal Crossing, do, uh, what's it called? Um, uh, watch movies or something on Discord. So that should be pretty fun. Uh, no, I'm not gonna do that. We're gonna heal the normal way. With Cure. Um, my schedule is in the panel. Uh, in the panels. It's a... Yeah, got an image there. Oh wait, we're going down to the gym, that's right. Oh, sick. I just want to get down there and save. Oh, fuck. Ooh, good chunk of damage there. Hey, Cup of Chris, how's it going, man? How you doing? Passing through the show, love. Hey, appreciate that very much. Uh, we're just, we're gonna be finishing up soon. We just want to beat all of the Shinra, uh, get out of Midgar for this play, th for this uh, start of the playthrough today. We're doing a uh, new threat mod, which is like a difficulty slash rebalancing mod, so it makes the game a bit more difficult. Adds a lot more strategy to it as well, which is pretty, it's pretty awesome so far, honestly. I love it. Uh, okay, let's keep going. Need to heal again. Does he have heal on him? Yeah, that's no, cool. Awesome. Actually, we can rest once we get down to the gym. Never mind. That's all good. Uh, yeah, come on, Chris. Where are you? Where are you coming through from? How did you uh, find my stream today? Just off the directory. Another old school Final Fantasy dude. I love it. It's so good. I love it. All right, awesome. Sweet, pop a save. Let's 
All right. Now we take the elevator out. Oh, excuse me. Fucking hay fever, man. Ah, that's rude. What? Go up. Book in New York. It's just browsing around. Ah, oh, cool, man. Awesome. Well, I appreciate you popping in. It's a trap. Yes. Hey, this song. This must have been a real thrill for you. Did you enjoy it? <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, dude. Well, yeah, so over the last couple of weeks, we've uh, been playing through all the Far Fantasy 7 games. So we did... We, we beat Remake within the first, like, two or so weeks. We played through Crisis Core, played through Doja Cerberus, and now we're doing the original with some mods. So, yeah, it's fun. It's pretty sweet, man. I love it. Uh, they got you too? Yep, they caught everyone. Where is Aerith? In a safe place. She's the last surviving ancient, or Setra, I should say. The Setra were a migrant race. Capable of speaking to the planet and using its power, now they're just a forgotten page in history. Cetra. That girl is a descendant of the Cetra? Yes, and the Cetra would have known the location of the Promised Land. I'm expecting a lot out of her. The Promised Land? Isn't that just a legend? That is a risk, but aren't all legends rooted in fact? It's been said that the promised land is very fertile. If the land is fertile, then there's got to be Marco. Exactly. If it exists, the promised land will hold an abundant supply of Marco. The land here is withered away, and if our reactors can't produce Marco, then Midgar has no future. So instead, we'll find the promised land and build Neo Midgar, Shinra's new glory. Can't keep dreaming. <laughs> yeah, fertile. <laughs> Wait, what's that emote? Who is that emote? I, I, I swear I recognize it. it. Looks anime inspired. We all have our dreams, but what it takes for dreams to come true is bunny and power. Tomorrow we'll put Avalanche on trial for the destruction of Sector 7. I'm afraid this will be our last meeting. Here comes Rude. Come on, out of this way. Hold it, I've got a lot to say, a lot of what to say to you. Then he gets dragged out. <laughs> Oh man. Poor Barrett, man. He's just trying to do the best he can. Is there anything else? Talk to my secretary. President Shinra. Oh, I have a feeling he's going to get his comeuppance soon.